Hey there, how's everybody? How's everybody doing? All right, a little bit of a beginner workout for a Saturday morning. Um, just gonna use one set of seven pound dumbbells, okay? Just to get some things going, get to get some movement. Um, I'll go through it once. Um, you can, it's gonna be in a circuit form. You could go through it again, okay? There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight exercises. So we'll go through probably in sets of 15 to 20, somewhere in there. Um, doesn't have to be overly hard, just get moving. And then I think for um, a, good, a good starting place or a good uh, goal would be to get through it twice. Maybe working up to getting through the whole thing three times. Um, but let's just start with the one time, okay? So we'll start with the, just the, the elbows to, to knees, kind of in a lateral sense. So be this way, and I'm just gonna kind of go here and go to the side, one, two, three, to get the sides working. You could also go kind of more, you know, in the front. If it was hard to go to the side, you could go to the front and do 20 that way, right? So that's fine to go to the front or to the side, 20. All right, now we're gonna go into like a squat with a kick. So you're just gonna come straight down, squat, and then kick, one, two. This will help actually stretch those hamstrings and that, that nerve out in the back too a little bit, okay? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I feel that nerve getting stretched back there. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16 here from the side, okay? 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, so that's, now I guess that's the legs worked up a little bit. Now let's grab the dumbbells and we're gonna do some easy um, shoulders, so just nice and tall, and just raise to the front. One, controlled. Two, so not swinging. Three, Four, five, six, seven, eight. It doesn't matter if you don't have dumbbells. This is ten. Pick up anything. This is seven pounds. Find something or just go through um, thirteen and go with no weights at all. Just move your arms. Fifteen, sixteen. 17, so you do about 90 degrees. 18, 19, 20. Okay, perfect, well done. Okay, now we're gonna go to more of a lateral lunge. I, I'm gonna hang on to my dumbbells. You don't have to, it's just, let's go about right here. We're gonna go kind of to the, to the side. One, two, three, four, five, thank you for the thumbs up, whoever it was, I appreciate it, six, seven, eight, thank you, nine, ten, eleven, go at your own pace, it doesn't matter how fast you go, we're just going to get twenty of these in to the side, I lost count, I think that's thirteen, <laughs> fourteen, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, okay? So that was a little bit of a lateral lunge. That was perfect. And then we're gonna kind of bend. So we're gonna work some, a little bit of back. We're not gonna bend at the waist, but we're like, it's not gonna be like this. That's not, we gotta protect that back and that neck, you see how slouchy that is? We're gonna bend forward at the hips and do a row this way for the back. 
But look at the difference between, between this, when my, when my butt's kind of out, my back is straight, my head, everything is in line. This is different than that. No, this is bad. This is better, okay? So, knees kind of soft, not locked back, a little bend. Bend the hips. So we're going to bend forward. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm not way down like this, head in alignment. Seven, eight, nine. I'm pulling the shoulder blades, I'm pinching my shoulder blades together. Ten. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, okay? That's a little bit of back, like upper back, that's what that was for on that one. Okay, now we're going to go down into, um, we're going to get on the ground now. We're going to get into a plank position. We won't do any push-ups, we're just going to get into a plank position. I hope this is still... So I come down here, we'll be in a bit of a plank, get the feet back, and we're just going to lift one leg up. One, two, three, four, come this way, so really use your, your butt muscle, okay? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, okay? So kind of that push-up position, you're just nice and strong. We're not going to do any push-ups, just hold, and you're going to kick those legs back. Take breaks if you need to, that was 20. Now we're going to go down into more of a side plank. We'll still be on our elbow, and probably on the knees. If you can go to the toes, that's fine. Um, but either, either on the side of your foot or on your knees, like so. Here, and then I'm gonna keep on my, this hip comes up off the ground and will hold for 20 seconds. This is the beginner version, okay? This would be more advanced to, have, to be on the feet all the way up, okay? But we're gonna just go on the knees for right now. So lift that hip up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Now if you get tired, you can always come back down and rest, but we'll just try to go for twenty seconds. Now let's switch to the other side. We gotta stay in a nice, nice straight line, okay? So I'm not bent, my upper thighs and my body is all straight line here, okay? So we're on the right side, now we're going to lift the hip up, one, two, this is straight here too as well, straight, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, 17, 18, 19, and 20 seconds and down. Okay, switch. I'm gonna grab my dumbbells again, and we're gonna do a little bit of a, um, this is actually the last one in the series. We're gonna do a little bit of a glute, um, glute and hamstring bridge on the edge of the, of the bench. And you can use anything that you have to put your upper back on in here, okay? I'm going to have these weights just rest them on my lap, and I'm keeping my, my bending at the hips, back straight, I'm dipping down, and then pushing up with my glutes and hamstrings, with this little bit of weight here, you don't have to use the weight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Keep the head and just a, don't be way forward like this. Just keep it kind of either rest it back or just in neutral. One, 
or 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. If you need the hands here to support that, that's fine too. 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay? Scoot yourself back up and then come on up. So that is a beginner uh, workout that I would use um, today for, hopefully a lot of you will be able to do that today on a Saturday. Um, it's a nice day and I hope all of, I hope all of my moms like Carrie right there. Hope all my moms have a great um, Mother's Day weekend. I uh, wish their, our weather was better, but that's a good little uh, beginner workout. That's one time through. Do that same thing another time through. If you still feel good, another time through. But that should be, you know, I think that's going to be around maybe 12 to 15 minutes to get through it a couple times. And it's a, it's a good little start to, um, for, the, for up, lower body, legs, hips, core, a little bit upper body with, with being in the, in the push-up position, some shoulders, and some, and some rows. So I hope you guys enjoyed that one. I just want to give you some positive energy and some positive, um, yeah, really just positive energy. Just give back to you so you feel like you've got some things you can work on. And, and do over the weekend, um, and I hope everybody has a great, great day.